I am Patrick Jones, and I will be revealing the results from when I backtested 100 U.S. equity funds. These U.S. equity funds <coughs> are a mixture of small growth and large growth funds extracted from Monistar.com. I was able to pull one-year returns, three-year returns, and turnover from each of these funds. I am backtesting an investment strategy to prove that funds with higher turnover will produce a lower return and funds with lower turnover will produce higher return. First, let's start off by running a couple regressions with the hypothesis being that there is no difference between returns for high turnover funds and low turnover funds. <coughs> The first regression includes turnover from each fund as the independent variable and one year returns from each fund as the dependent variable. The regression tells us that there is a negative relationship between turnover and one year returns with the coefficient being negative 0 0.02. But there is no diff significant difference between the p-value of, of 0.32 is greater than 0 0.05, and the T stat of negative 0.98 is less than negative 1.65. The second regression includes turnover from each fund as the independent variable, and three year returns from each fund as the dependent variable. The regression tells us that there is a negative relationship between turnover and three-year returns with the coefficient being negative 0 0.01. And there is a significant difference between the p-value of 0 0.03, which is less than 0 0.05. And the t-stat of negative 2.08 is less than negative 1.65. The negative relationship between turnover and both one-year and three-year returns explains that when turnovers increase, returns decrease. Second, I'll be running a difference of means test with two sample assuming unequal variances. I was able to split the funds between the 50 funds with the lowest turnover and, and um, the 50 funds with the highest turnover. I first tested one year low, low turnovers against one year high turnovers, and the numbers conclude that funds with low turnovers have higher returns than funds with high turnovers. There is also a significant difference. There's a T-stat of 2.91, which is greater than 1.65, and a p-value one-tail test of 0 0.002, which is less than 0 0.05. Next, I tested three-year low turnovers against three year high turnovers and the numbers conclude again that funds with low turnovers have higher returns than funds with high turnovers. There's a significant difference again. There's a T stat of 1.6, 1.86, which is greater than 1.65 and a P value one tail test of 0 0.03, which is less than 0 0.05. This information shows <coughs> that overall low turnover funds outperform high turnover funds, which in turn helps me reject the hypothesis that there's no difference between returns for <coughs> high turnover funds and low turnover funds. Have a blessed day.